so we are going to go over our ingredients for this super complicated complex powerful as fuck spell so y'all just stay tuned we are going to be needing some spicy hex oil spicy banishing oil commanding oil uncrossing oil adam and eve oil elecompe root marjoram salt vinegar ground fennel some string some hot foot powder i am using my beautiful amethyst crystals for this have some buffalo teeth for a spell like this you definitely want as many as you can get i have a skull candle to represent the person's mind i want to clear the person's mind i want to change we are not only doing a breakup spell and a banishing spell we also want to push this person to realize his true feelings for his ex to want her back to stop being with this toxic horrible person he's with now i have a candle here that is going to represent what we are banishing from him so this is basically his family's hold over him they hate my client they don't want him with her we want to banish their objections we want to banish their control over him so i'm going to burn the spirit powder down and wrap it around this candle. I have a few binded mini red candles for love. We want to make him realize that he is still in love with my client. We want to make sure he knows that she still loves him, that there is a possibility for their relationship there. So for the first time on this channel, I will be using a actual breakup candle. You will need a knife. We are going to put it right through the middle of these two people. And also, you will need to write your spirit or intention powder on a piece of paper, everything that you want to happen. And then you want to write, I'm not gonna show you, but basically when the paper's out, you want to write the name of one, on one side, the name of the other on the other side. And when it's time to make the spirit powder, you tear this apart because you're tearing up their relationship. And then that's what we're going to anoint this candle with. And of course, I always like to put some dried flowers or plants on mine. So that's what these are for. All right, we are going to start by working on our candles. The first candle I'm going to address is our banishing candle. We're going to light up the spirit powder. All right, now that that is done burning, we are going to mix in some of our alicompe root, especially powerful for banishing. And now we're going to mix in some of our spicy banish oil. All right, so on this candle, I already have written uh, what I want to banish. I want to banish his family's power over him. I want to banish um, his need for their approval. So I'm going to scoop this out and anoint this candle. All right, now that we have done that, I am going to burn our love and attraction and remembrance spirit powder, intention powder. All right, now that that has burned down, I'm going to sprinkle in some margarine for added love and attraction benefit. I'm going to add in my Adam oil, which is made with Adam root, calendula, rose petals, and Queen Elizabeth root. I'm going to add my Eve oil, which is made with Eve root, rose petals, calendula, and Queen Elizabeth root. Oh, and I did put some lavender in this one along with rose quartz. All right, 
right, so now we get to the kind of complicated part. So like I said before, you're going to write the two people's names that you want to break up on either side of this paper. I wrote a bunch of sigils, exactly what I wanted to happen. I put my intentions into it. Now, I'm going to tear. These people will break up. And I am going not to fold them, but to crush them. Because I want to crush their relationship. It is in my control. We'll just light those up. All right, so now for this, we are going to add in our hot foot powder because we want this to happen fast. It will be no question that these people shouldn't be together. I'm going to add some salt to make their relationship salty. I'm going to add some vinegar, some spicy hex oil. and some commanding oil. All right, so now we are going to take our breakup candle. We are going to sprinkle some fennel on here. and some hot foot powder. Okay, so for the funnest part of this, we are going to drive a wedge between this couple. We are going to light the end of the night. You just melt the end and you press it right down into the middle. All right, lastly, we are going to work on our Clarity Skull Candle. So since I made this by hand, it already has intention and spirit powder built into it, along with some commanding and uncrossing herbs. So the only thing I'm going to do to this is rub some uncrossing and um, commanding oil on here. going to pour a little bit of fennel on this one. All right, so let me catch you up if anyone is confused as to what each candle here means. So basically this main candle in this spell is this break up candle. That is the main purpose here. We want to break these people up. My client was with this guy since she was 15 and their high school sweethearts. She is still madly in love with him. This other woman got in the way, so we are trying to push her away. His family has decided to support his new girlfriend, so we are going to banish their authority and thoughts over him. We are going to clear his mind of any negativity towards my client. We are going to open his mind to see that he is still in love with her, that that is who he wants to be with. These pink candles are just a semblance of the love that we want our, that I want my client to gain from this spell. It is going to be facing this skull. I want this skull to look at the love he could have with my client. All right, so the next thing we're gonna do is just secure our candles down on our plate. All right, so as we're looking at the timeline of this spell, the first thing we want to happen is we want these people to break up. We want his family's opinion and bias to stop mattering to him. We want to clear his mind and make him only see my client. And that is why he is facing the love that they want shared, the love that they could have again. So just so everyone's clear on the timeline of this spell, all right, so let's start adding our extra elements to this. I'm going to sprinkle a little bit of fennel 
all over this plate because I want all of these people to be commanded by my will. We're going to put buffalo teeth facing our spell. Going to place my amethysts on here, my roses. All right, guys, this is the end of our preparation for our breakup, banishing, binding spell. Love spell, clarity spell. There's so much intention put into this. I was up so late writing and writing and writing for this intention powder. I put my words into it so strongly. So we are going to get this set up on my table and I will be back with you guys in just a second to light this up. Thanks again for watching guys and I hope you enjoyed this. I hope this helped you out. Make sure you leave me some feedback. I love to know what you guys think. So I will talk to you all soon. Bye lovelies. Bye,